Approximately 200 military advisors are now on the ground. We have established a joint operations center with Iraqis in Baghdad. None of these troops are performing combat missions. None will perform combat missions. President Obama has been very clear that American combat troops are not going to be fighting in Iraq again. Well, first of all, this is not 2003. It's not 2006. This is a very different approach than we've, than we've taken in the past. I mean, assessing and advising and enabling are very different words than uh, uh, attacking, defeating, and disrupting. We may get to that point if our national interests drive us there, if ISIL becomes such a threat to the homeland that, that the President of the United States, with our advice, decides that we have to take direct action. I, I'm just suggesting to you we're not there yet. In terms of the open-endedness of it, I, Jim, you've heard me say before that the, the, th the ideology that stretches from South Asia across the Arab world and into North and West Africa, the ideology which is essentially an anti-Western, very conservative, religious, and in some cases, radically violent ideology, we're, we're stuck with that for the foreseeable future. A generation...